Hello everyone and welcome you all to Quick Solutions for All India Akash Test Series Medical 2020. Today I am going to take up the zoology part of the paper which is test paper number 4 code A and B in zoology. So let's get started with our very first question. Question number 136 biopiracy is and the options given are distribution of bioresources fairly, patenting bioresources with authorization, use of bioresources without authorization and the last option given is destroying bioresources. Biopiracy is the term used to refer to the use of bioresources by multinational companies and other organizations without proper authorization from the countries and people concerned without compensatory payment. So the correct answer to this question is option number three, use of bioresources without authorization without authorization is the correct answer. Whereas option number one, distribution of bioresources fairly. Option number two, patenting bioresources with authorization are incorrect options. And the last option, destroying bioresources is also an incorrect option. And the correct answer to this question is option number three. Let's discuss our next question. Question number 137, bioremediation of oil spills is carried out by which genetically engineered microorganism? And the options given are Escherichia coli, Rhizobium leguminosarum, Salmonella typhi, and the last option is Pseudomonas putida. Bioremediation is a strategy that uses naturally occurring organisms to break down pollutants such as petroleum hydrocarbons into less toxic substances. Bioremediation of oil spills is carried out by Pseudomonas putida. So the correct answer is option number 4. Let's discuss the rest of the options. Ascarichia coli or E. coli is a suitable heterologous host used in genetic engineering such as pharmaceutical manufacturing of humulin. Human insulin. So this cannot be a correct answer. Next option is rhizobium leguminosarum. And this cannot be a correct answer to our question because rhizobium leguminosarum is a nitrogen fixing symbiotic bacteria with leguminous plants. The next option given is Salmonella typhi and this is an incorrect option. Infection with Salmonella typhi causes typhoid. So the correct answer to this question is option number 4. Let's discuss our next question. Question number 138. Which among the following is not a recombinant therapeutic product approved and marketed in India? And the options are aldosterone, hepatitis B vaccine, human growth hormone and humulin. At present, 12 recombinant Therapeutic products are approved and marketed in India including hepatitis B vaccine, human growth hormone and humulin. So these are the incorrect options. Whereas aldosterone is not a recombinant therapeutic product approved and marketed in India. So this is a correct answer to our question. Aldosterone is a salt retaining hormone. So, the correct answer to this question is option number 1. Let's discuss our next question. Question number 139. Blank produced using RDT is used as a clot buster for removing thrombus. Select the correct option which fills the blank and the options given are streptokinase, clotting factor 8, erythropoietin and human interleukin. Streptokinase produced by streptococcus using RDT is used as clot buster for removing thrombus. So this is a correct answer to our question. The next option given is clotting factor 8 and this cannot be a correct answer to our question. This clotting factor is an anti-hemophilic factor A involved in blood clotting. The next option is erythropoietin and this cannot be a correct answer to our question. Erythropoietin is synthesized from JG cells of kidney promoting erythropoiesis. And the last option is human interleukin. And this is an incorrect option. 
interleukins are lymphokines that activate immune system. So, this cannot be a correct answer. And the correct answer to this question is option number 1. Now, let's discuss our next question. Question number 140. Melting of DNA at 94 degrees Celsius is due to breakdown of and the options are glycosidic bonds, phosphodiester bonds, disulfide bonds and the last option given is hydrogen bonds. Now, melting of DNA at 94 degrees Celsius or denaturation is defined as the temperature at which 50% of double-stranded DNA changed to single-stranded DNA. 50% double-stranded DNA changes to single-stranded DNA by breaking hydrogen bonds between complementarily based paired nucleotides. So, the correct answer to this question is option number 4, hydrogen bonds. Let's discuss the rest of the options. The very first option given is glycosidic bonds and this cannot be a correct answer. The next option is phosphodiester bonds and this is an incorrect option. Phosphodiester bond is present between two successive sugar moieties in same strand of DNA or polynucleotide. And the next option is disulfide bonds and this cannot be a correct answer because disulfide bond is a covalent bond derived from two thiol groups of cysteine residues. So, the correct answer to this question is option number 4. Let's discuss our next question. Mm -hmm. 